This is clamshell with upper body row. This is an advanced exercise for trunk stability, hip strength, and disassociation between the upper and lower body. This has a lot of carryover. When we talk about walking and running, we need to have that ability to dissociate the pelvis from the hip and from the upper body. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our band, we're gonna put it around our legs. We need a second band, and this is the band we're gonna row with. It doesn't need to be very heavy. It needs to be just a little bit of resistance to help us work on disassociating that upper body. So we're gonna get on our side here. We don't wanna be up in that side bent position. We wanna be laying on that bottom arm or have this arm out in front of us. We wanna think about pulling the side, bottom side up a little bit first, bringing the leg up. And what we're gonna do from here, and I need to scoot out a little bit because I want my arm to start in a straight position here. Once I get that clamshell position, bottom or top leg up, what I'm going to do from here is simply row with my upper body. Now first, I'm not going to let my upper body twist. I'm simply going to hold this for a few seconds and then slowly let that arm back out, bring that leg back down, lift up again with my leg, pull with my arm. If I can do 10 good reps here where I can hold that row and my leg in good position for five seconds each rep, what I want to progress then to is bringing my legs back into a straighter position. This is going to work that lateral hip at a different angle. I'm going to row, but now I'm going to rotate my upper body a little bit, trying not to let my pelvis turn with me. So I don't want to see your hips open up as you turn your upper body back. We want to be very stable, keep that pelvis stacked up, bring that arm back, turn the chest, Hold for about a five second count, then let that arm back forward, the chest rotate back forward, leg back down. Keep those abs engaged, lift the leg up, pull back, rotate that upper body, try not to let the hips turn with you. And then back, and bring the leg back down. Again, try to work up to 10 repetitions of five second holds. 